New at four, a case of animal cruelty. Investigators are searching for the person who shot a cat in the head with an arrow. This is video of the cat. It did survive, but it has a long recovery ahead. Channel 2's Barrett Peterson is live in Rome, where the animal is now on the mend. Barrett. Well, that old saying about having nine lives may be true because this is what was removed from the cat's skull. The first time Christy LaRue got a good look at this orange tabby, she couldn't believe her eyes. I was just in shock and disbelief that, number one, that somebody would do that to a cat. Number two, that the cat was alive. This is video from last Saturday after the cat had been shot at close range with a pistol crossbow. An arrow-like dart called a bolt was stuck in its head. The animal was found in southwest Floyd County. Animal Control called Christy, who runs a local pet rescue. She rushed him to a veterinary clinic in Rome where an x-ray showed the weapon had cracked the cat's skull. It looks healed up pretty well. But after emergency surgery, his doctor is cautiously optimistic. We ruled out a brain injury. It was our major concern. However, we are still, he's not fully out of the woods because he might be still facing some complication like infection or, or internal bleeding to the brain. Now Floyd County police are trying to find the shooter. LaRue hopes they can make an arrest. Because I feel like if they're going to do it now, they're going to do it again. I think somebody needs to be stopped and they need to understand that this is not, some, this is not okay. It's not okay to treat an animal like that. And I mean, that's, you know, that's cruelty. Here's another look at this weapon. Christy says this tomcat is definitely a fighter, which is why they named him Floyd Mayweather. You boxing fans have certainly heard of him, and there's already a long list of folks who want to adopt him. We're live in Rome, Baron Peterson, Channel 2 Action News.